morning, good morning. Welcome to PK Fitness 4.21. Grab you a set of dumbbells and we about to jump right on to it this morning. We got eight exercises for Shocktober. We're going to do a squat punch. So you'll have the dumbbells facing you. You're going to squat and twist it out. Squat, twist it out. Alternating arms. After that, we're going to do a side crunch. You're going to have a single dumbbell up over your head, arms slightly bent, and just stand on that side. And then the second one is you're going to hold those dumbbells up and just squat. Bringing them up. You're not squeezing your glutes. Just bring them up. Now, if you want to, you can hold it there the entire time. That's actually the way that it go. But after us doing all these weights all week, I kind of was dropping my arms. <laughs> and, then we'll do, and, and then we'll do the crunch on the other side, okay? And then after that, same leg, same arm. Knee up, arm up. And you're just going to take the foot down and back up. Down and back up. You're just going to hold that up, bringing that knee up. Mm -hmm. to the and then after that, whew, <laughs> after that, we're going to do an alternating knee crunch twist. So you're going to knee crunch twist with the dumbbell, twisting it around, okay? And then after that, we're going to do a one leg, whew, wait a minute, yeah, the alternating knee and then the other side of the arm, the one leg, and then we're going to do a burpee. No, 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 not that, not that burpee. I'm about to give y'all another burpee. I'm about to give y'all another burpee. Okay. Okay, so so this is kind of like a modified burpee, or you want to do burpees, but you don't feel like doing the burpee burpee. So you're going to spread your feet shoulder width apart. You're going to start with your arms over your head, swing them down, bring them up, and press. Up, squat, up, press. Up, squat, up, press. Stand up burpees. All right? Those are the wonderful eight beautiful exercises. Are y'all ready? Let's go. We're starting with that squat punch. Go. I'm turning up the bottom. Okay. okay. Inhale, exhale. Breathe through your nose. Engage that core. Ooh. I definitely gotta put on my new braces. Keep going. Three, two, one, break. Standing side crunch. One dumbbell. Three, two, one. Elbow slightly bent. Bringing that knee up. You should feel that pull on the opposite side of that oblique. Pull it in. Good job. Come on. Inhale. Exhale. And rest. We're going to do that dumbbell squat. Dumbbell out in front. Let's go. Oh, I put that down too far. <laughs> nice and controlled. Inhale. Exhale. Always inhale when it's easy. Exhale when it's hard. Feet facing forward, knees facing forward. Push those hips back like you're going to go sit down. Remember, push it back. Three, two, one, break. Other side. Stand aside, crunch. Woo! Let's go. Make sure you got a good grip. You bend your elbows. You want to straighten them out. Totally up to you. <laughs> or you can do a little bit of both. Good 
modify. Just bring that foot up a little bit. You don't have to crunch. Or you can stand and do side bends. If you can't raise your legs, that would be the modified version. Five seconds. All right, single arm up, high knee. Three, two, one, go. Get that hand on that hip, Miss April. Okay. <laughs> Help your balance better. Find your focus point. If you find yourself off balance, make sure you got your hand on your hip. Make sure you're not leaning. Stand straight up. Come on. Read through it. Ten seconds. Ooh, that elbow was dropping. <laughs> Woo! All right, we're gonna do that twist. Alternating twist. Let's go. Twist. 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 Now if you can't get the knees up again, you can always stand stationary and rotate. Or if you get tired, don't stop. Go to the modify. And then as soon as you can, get back into it. I'm sweating like I'm crying over here. <laughs> I'm like, wait a minute. Come on, pull it behind you. Pull it, pull it, pull it. Keep that dumbbell up. Waist level, not hip level. Break, other arm. One arm up. Let's go. Stand straight up. Arm straight up. Bring that knee up. So I'm glad I'm watching myself because I see my elbow bending. <laughs> I have to catch it. Arms straight. You got to come bring it down, shake it off, and put it back up. Get right back to it. That's why I always say choose your waist wisely. <laughs> Five seconds. Read through it. Ooh. Grab them both. Standing burpee. <laughs> Arms Three, up. Two, one. Let's go. Up. Press. <sighs> yes, come on. Look how y'all killing them burpees. Nobody likes burpees. <laughs> Ah! Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Yes, come on, five seconds. Three, two, one, three. Woo! Get you some water. <laughs> Good job. Good job. Round one. Check it out. Complete. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sips of water. No sitting. Keep moving. Keep moving. Welcome to PNK Fitness 4.21. This is Shocktober. We about to get in. Pink Fit Camp is in the building. Y'all just completed round one. If you don't have dumbbells, grab two bottles of water, grab two cans, or just use your body weight. It will work sufficiently and efficiently, just as if you have a set of dumbbells. All right, about 20 more seconds. And we're going to do the next round. <laughs> don't, 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 don't. Keep moving. Don't, 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 don't. Keep moving. Ow, ow, ow. Keep moving. All right. How your arms feeling? <laughs> Woo, take some deep breath. And we're going to do it all over again. All right, 
I think I just hit the wrong one. What's this? I think I hit the wrong one. Yeah, I was on the wrong one. That sounded like funeral music. <laughs> I'm like, no, no, no. No, no. Oh, come on with the with the 30 second uh survey thing. They never made that survey thing that long. You can skip it as soon as it opened up. Since the new year, YouTube has changed a lot of their guidelines. I probably should start reading those emails, huh? <laughs> Right. <laughs> <laughs> Probably should start reading the emails. Because these survey things you used to just skip. All right, in five seconds, we're going to start. Whew. Here we go. This workout right here is a high intensity interval workout with 30 seconds work and 10 seconds rest for a total of 10 pounds. We only do an eight, y'all. We only do an eight. Then we're going to do another eight. October. Let's go. Squat and punch. Go at your pace. Make sure you're sitting in that squat right. Don't lean forward. Keep that chest upright. So when you're going down, up. Down, up. If you lean forward, you got to bring it back up to punch. So don't lean forward. Not this. We're going to go straight down. And to make sure you're doing that, you can kind of sit the edge of your dumbbells on top of your shoulders. All right, stand to side crunch. Start with the side you finished with the last time. This one. Woo! Three, two, one, let's go. Come on, make it worth it. You didn't get up this early this morning. To just go through the motions so you can post and say workout complete it ain't a workout if you don't work it out like I said you can fake a lot of things but hard work is definitely not one of them so let's go you want those results Ooh, this wet burn of mine Woo. all right squat with the dumbbell Like 15 seconds instead of 10. Let's go. That seemed really good. It's supposed to be 10. I think it's 15. Oh. Oh. Inhale, exhale. Breathe through that nose. Blow it out through first lift. Come on. All right, other side. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, it's 15 seconds. That's all right. Our arms are taking us. <laughs> Ooh. Come on. Oh, I should be doing that to the side. I'm on to the front. Come on. Ah. Inhale. Inhale. Exhale. Come on. I think this is everybody's favorite. One arm up. <laughs> start with that opposite arm you finished with. I mean, start with the arm you finished with. Let's go. Oh, glad that, glad that was a commercial before it stopped. We do offer free cancellation. We got we got lucky that time. Go. <laughs> we got lucky they did that commercial on the break. <laughs> Come on, don't lean. Make sure you're not leaning back too. You don't want to apply no pressure on your back. Make sure you're standing upright. Upright. Arms straight up, no bend. Pull it close by your ear. Not out here, by the ear. And break. 
gonna do our twist. If you want, we'll do mini tw trunk twist this time. Mini trunk twist. If you wanna raise your legs, you can. Let's go. Mini trunk twists are fast. Nice and fast. Hit the hip. Now if you wanna bring your legs up, you can. That is optional, but the, the dumbbells are up here instead of down here. That's the difference. I wanted you to see the difference. Versus up here to here. All right, other arm. Is it staying on? Jesus Christ. <laughs> Let's go. You might look at this and be like, oh, that's easy. Come on, get with us. Get up and try it. This one, if you in your bed, you can stand right by your bed and get back in it when you're done. Try it. <laughs> inhale. Right, inhale. Exhale. I get so many people be like, girl, I'm in my bed watching you. Or I'm eating Twizzlers and watching you. Or I'm eating this and watching you. And I'll be like, uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> and break. Ooh. Burpee. Burpee. <sighs> Swing them arms on up. Standing burpee is what we're doing. Ooh. Almost there. Come on. Break. <laughs> what you said, that little lady crazy? talking to it because when um what's her name teach be like why when you say certain things i'll be feeling like you can see me because she do it on the replay she said when i say something it come right at the time you like get your chin out your chest she be like dang can she see me <laughs> so i just laugh it off uh, that's why i always somebody's like you talk through the whole workout i said and do and will i said because the ones that do it afterwards i gotta make sure that they're doing it right and that's one of the things i want to make sure people also are executing the exercises correctly and not just going through the motion and thinking they're doing them right because I'm not there. So that's why I put the video up from yesterday. It's on YouTube. So if you want to do that workout, it's there. And this one will go up uh, probably tomorrow. I'm going to get one today, a little bit of chance. Where is my? The one that I want. The one that I want. Okay. Always, always. That's how it be. I should have just went and searched in the first place. All right, get a couple more sips of water, and we're about to stop. I, I, I know it's going to give me a commercial. I'm tired of this other song. I want my other song. <laughs> okay, let me go to start. Let me just put an insert real quick. Uh-oh, not that one. So we can have fun with this last one. <laughs> we, we, we having fun. We having a whole lot of fun. But we gonna have a little bit more with the music. Y'all know I, how I get when I get with the music. Okay, it ain't coming up. I'm just gonna go with what come up. Come on. Because I, I can't type it fast enough. I mean, I could, but it's taking too long. All right. We just gonna go with Crazy in Love. That was the one COVID first one popped up. Some people get it, and some people can get it. We crazy in love with working out, so we just gonna go with that one. <laughs> 
I just don't get it. Some of y'all be like, uh, no, you crazy in love with working out. All right, squat punch. Let's go. My legs feel heavy. Stand aside, crunch. So your chest is to the front, your leg is to the side. Come on. Inhale, exhale. Pull that core in. Come on. And stop. Squat dumbbell next. Woo! All these squats, I'm chewing up these shorts. Let's go. Chest up. Not down. Nope. Chest up. Come on. Woo! Other side. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. You're gonna... Hey! Three, two, one. Let's go. Come on. Get up. Let's go. Come on. Bye. Woo. Single arm up. Straight up. Body straight up. Straight up. Chin up. A lot of y'all like looking down when y'all working out. Ain't nothing down there but your hot air and sweat. All right. Woo! You can choose whichever you want to do. Mini trunk twist or a knee up. I'm going to do a little bit of both. Let's go. Other arm. Let's go. What mommy call y'all, Jada? <laughs> beast. Come on. She's calling them Beast. She called Jada Jane from Tarzan. She called. She, she, she called. She called Pebble something. I don't forgot. She be tripping. The mama arm. I ain't messing with y'all, Beast. All right, burpees. She said, and the ones you be with online in the morning. She ain't leave y'all out, April Nikita. Don't worry. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, I forgot the. Ooh, this one I wish I was at the gym and I could just throw the weights across from. <laughs> Did your mom put the tire when we were Yeah. I got a video. I videotaped it. Tell my son. I put the words up there. She said, no, nah, I'm going to leave it to y'all beast. And when she flipped it, it said, welcome to Beast Nation. So she did it right with the rest of them. At Jersey Mike's, All right. They gotta see Woo, let's do this one minute part. Right in front of you. Look at that Let's get it on out the way. Yep, there's some things you just one minute plank, any plank of your choice. All right. Well, this guy and ten. Pulling off business and casual. Besides you. Four, three, two, let's go. Uh, Welcome to Tobacco. You're going to be low. 
Get at an angle for you. You want to get everything level. Now hold your head down. Hold that head up. You can put your feet apart if you find it hard to balance. Otherwise, beginners, drop the knees. Feet up. Head up the whole time. Right? Go back into it. You can do a high plank if you wish. No booties in the air. Everything nice and level. From your neck to your spine. Come on, 30 seconds. Hold it. Now don't dip either, because you're going to cause pain in your lower back. Now if you feel pain in your back, you can raise your butt out up a little bit. But if you still feel pain, I prefer you go back to your knees. It'll be a lot safer for you until you build the strength of your core, which will help build the strength in your spine. Okay? And your back. Come on, give me five seconds. Core tight. And jump. Woo! All right. Stomach back in. Three sets of stomach vacuums. Don't worry, we're going to go back down. Y'all want to do your bicycle crunch or y'all going to do them on your own? <laughs> they like, no, we're going to do that together. Okay. Let's do the stomach vacuums. Go ahead with the first set. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale. Don't exhale. Blow all the excess of air out of your lungs and then hold it as long as you can. So you're going to take your navel and introduce it to your spine. Ooh, come on, core. Next set, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, don't exhale, tilt and squeeze. Let's go. Three, two, one, go. Make sure you're keeping those shoulders relaxed. Last set. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale. Don't exhale. Tilt, tuck. Squeeze and tilt. Let's go. My poop was sensitive. <laughs> Somebody else said, yeah. yeah. I'm like, ooh, when I did that, when I pulled that TVA, and I'm like, okay. All right. So we're going to do today's exercise for the 100 rep is bicycle crunches. I posted the video like at 3, 4 this morning, no, 5, 6 this morning, about 5 this morning. So it's up with modifications. You can do it with resistance tubing. Um, I showed how you can add ankle weights on your ankles if you want to. Um, you can do it without the twist. You can just pedal if you want. When You you know, it's 100 reps. So during that course of time, I'm going to show while we're here live as well, the modifications and the other options. All right? So everybody down. Let's pray um, she cooperate today. Because <laughs> uh, she been acting funky. All right, Alexa, count down from 100. 100 Go! 99, 98, 97, New Year's resolutions do not work for everyone. But here's Get that the shoulder up off the floor. You can start a mindfulness or a meditation practice. Or my personal favorite, you can speak with a license. Now for those who are modified, you can stay down on the floor. Therapist. And just twist. Make sure you all have your core engaged. Just twist. The other modified way is knee up. 
If you want to add a little bit more, if you can't do the leg stretch out, keep the leg left, elevate it in the air, okay? In case you have a thought that you'd like to discuss, or maybe you just want to bet, but you know what that is, you have an accountability partner, which means no more excuses. And don't get the help that knows you wrong. Exhale out that core. Using the freshness of the new year is great motivation. Still, as a collective, we place all of this superstition on January 1st. As from 38, Or if you want to, you can just go steady. She on 30. She counting down, remember. So if you want to just pedal, you can. 22, 21, Time. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Don't do what I'm doing. Get up. No. I love you. I never even put the resistance to her. Huh? Oh, the Mike Tyson push up. Listen, the way my arms feel, I feel like I can hit somebody like Mike Tyson right now. <laughs> the way these arms feel after this week. <laughs> All right, we have the Mike Tyson push-ups. Do as many as you can between five and 10. All right? You're gonna put your feet up against a wall or something, a couch, something. Feet have to be against the wall. I'm sure y'all been watching the Mike Ch Challenge. If you can go out and do a push-up, do a push-up, or like the rest of us, we're building to that push-up. Or you can do a half in the elbows and come back up, whatever works for you. But extend all the way out into the high plank. So you're gonna start with your butt back here by your heels. You're gonna place your hands down, and then you're gonna exert yourself and push out and up. And measure yourself. Do your push up, push back. Don't go down. Your knees gotta stay off the floor. Only because you don't got no seat in them. I don't know what I'll tell you. Okay, I got no sneakers on my feet. Woo! And I'm still trying to recover this broke toe. It's better though. Let's grab those lucky business hoops. We're gonna do 15 minutes of extreme power hooping. Seven and a half minutes on each side. If you're watching and not participating yet, Go follow me. PK Fitness 4.21 is my YouTube channel. PK Fitness 4.21 is my Facebook group page. Instagram is PK underscore fitness underscore 421. Um, yeah. And um, <laughs> TikTok is Coach Pinky underscore PK Fitness 421. I lost my train of thought. We looked up on my Tyson boots up. All right, it's Gut Buster Friday. Ooh, I'm changing to the. All right, everybody got their hoop. Come on, Lollipop. and shake it, baby. Too deep in there. <laughs> we're doing, we're extreme power hooping with our um, 10 pounders this morning if you have one. So if you have a gut buster, grab your gut buster and get your 15 minutes in. All right, everybody ready? You're gonna start on your unsafe side. If you hear the beat, you can go ahead and begin. I didn't hear it. It just went off. Okay. I would go to yoga. It just went off. I don't have the right gear. 
All right. Oh. All the best active wear yeah. Sierra. Also, I might have sent a link to my instructor. So you all made it through your first week of the new year. Ooh, my yeah. head cut off. <laughs> We all made it. We all, I said you all. We all made it through the first week of the, of the new year, right? Yes. For those that are online that are watching, if you made the new year resolution to work out, did you make it through the first week? Even if you did one day, that counts. That's a start. <laughs> it's a start. So a lot of people get on this weight loss journey. Some people get on the weight gain journey. Some people get on the want to maintain journey. And the ones that's on the maintain journey is the ones who lost what they want to lose. Now they just want to work out to maintain it, which would be me. Um, and the others that are working out with me on Zoom. We still have areas that we particularly want to work on to keep in hands. Because I feel like if I stop working on my arms, the fat will return. And it will. <laughs> so, this week, this week was a lot of arm work. <laughs> a whole lot of arm work. And y'all know weights are always optional. Anytime you can put some weights in your hand or use a resistant band or resistant tubing, I encourage you to do so. So I have a lot of people talk to me about, oh, I did the keto diet. And da -da -da -da. But when you stop doing the keto diet, what happened? You gained the weight back. <laughs> oh, I did, the, I did the weight loss, weight watchers. And when you stop, what happened? You gained the weight back. I did the Nutrisystem, it really worked. Is it Nutrisystem, Nutrisweet, Nutrisystem, right? I did that, and what, you stopped, and you gained it back. That's because, first of all, I don't know what they put in the middle. They, they call it some nutritional. I don't trust it, but that's, you know, my own thoughts. I just be like, what y'all putting in here for us to drop this weight this fast, okay? <laughs> but you have to remember, when you lose weight that fast, at, at a fast pace like that, and not gradually, it's you're setting yourself up to gain it back two or three times than what you lost. So a lot of people go, oh my gosh, okay, I want to stop. Because uh, what I hear, keto and all of those are very expensive. And even the other people now that have gotten into doing the box meal plans where they prep the food for you and melt it to you, I hear it's like 200 and something dollars a month. <laughs> y'all better, better go to the farmer's market and get y'all some vegetables and steam it or air or whatever y'all do with it and freeze it and make your own stuff. Like, that's expensive. Or it might have been 200 a week, if I'm not mistaken. It might have been a week. I'm like, that's daycare. Like, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, for me, that's, that's, that's grocery and gas. I'm like, uh-uh. So, you know, but like myself, I'm very busy. So coming home, cooking a meal at 7, 8 o'clock at night is not my ordeal. So I already have something here. So nine times out of 10, I'm going to eat salad. Or I might, or might, you know, oh, I want some breakfast. Scramble me some eggs or something. I try to do something that's going to be beneficial and not, you know, have the mindset of thinking you ruined your day because you came home and ate something else. So y'all know I don't use the term diet and PNK Fitness 41. I will talk about it, but we don't go on diets and PNK Fitness 41. We don't restrict ourselves and limit ourselves because that makes you unhappy and that makes you also set up for failure. You're like, man, forget this. I'm going to get me what I want. So maintaining your weight loss. Ladies, how have you been, you feel like you've been maintaining? Yes. Yeah. Oh, okay. And and don't think about the weight goal you want to be at. Just think about the healthy part. Not you not you all, but just in general. Of where you are from where you came from. You know what I mean? So even if you use like, oh, I really wanted to get to this by the new year. Okay, even if you got five pounds off and you really wanted to do 10 or 20, five pounds is better than not. So just keep that in mind. Don't don't zone in and hone in on I didn't reach what I wanted to do. Now your potential is to keep going and get to where you need to be. So most people who have lost weight gain it back. About 50% will gain it back within the first two years. And that, that comes with not just losing weight, doing diets. It comes with the cosmetic surgery as well. It comes with working out and not doing it the right way. So, uh, nine times out of ten, you're going to gain it back within two years. And you're definitely going to be frustrated because you're spending lo lots and lots of money for something that started out working and then all of a sudden it didn't. So, how do you avoid your um, weight regain? Anybody have an idea? Keep moving. Keep moving. You got to eat right, yeah, you can't overindulge in anything. Exactly. So they said, eat right, nutrition, don't overindulge. 
So the one thing is consistent, consistent and structured eating habit. I know you'd be like, girl, I'm tired of eating this. Like, I, I eat oatmeal every morning for breakfast. And sometimes I'll be like, you know what? Today is the day I'm going to get me a five-piece French toast steaks from Burger King. Or I'll be like, okay, I'm going to get my little sausage biscuit sandwich from McDonald's. And I take the sausage off the bread and put jelly on I'm, I'm our geechee. So, you know, we eat the biscuits like you're supposed to eat. The top of syrup and put jelly on it. I don't eat it as a breakfast sandwich. So, those are the things that I do throughout the week just to break up that monotony of being restricted to just oatmeal. Oatmeal, oatmeal, and so that I don't get sick of it, and then I lose focus of it and get off track. So that's the things that I do, maybe once or twice out of the week, so that I can keep what I need to keep going, going. Because you know those two things aren't bad things. So don't knock yourself if you feel like, oh, I'm gonna go to Dunkin' Donut and get me this glazed donut. Okay, <laughs> you know it's okay. You work for it. You you work you work for it. And then throughout the rest of the day. All the walking and stuff you're doing is going to work it back off the calories burn. So you don't feel guilty. Now, if you go buy a six a box of six donuts and you eat the six donuts, then yeah, that's the problem. <laughs> so it's consistent and structured eating habits. Exercise often. High levels of physical activity through short bursts like brisk walking, a, a light jog, going swimming. Eat lots and lots and lots and lots of what y'all think I'm going to say? Water. I said eat. <laughs> no, that's coming up next. Protein. Protein. A lot of people be, you know, on the fiber and on the, the grains. Protein. It's very important. Now, I don't do the supplements. I don't, I, you know, to eat your own. If you sprinkle it on, just be mindful of it. Always, always, always check with your doctor because there are a lot of side effects that come with a lot of those powder proteins, okay? So just be mindful of it. I did my research on it and I wasn't too fond of it. But just be mindful of it. It, it worked for some and it doesn't work for others. But just be careful because if you start having certain issues and you don't know where it's coming from, it could be from that or it could be from something else. So just be alert so if it does happen, you're kind of aware. Or if you're having a problem, you can say, hey, if taking this, can that be a contributor to that? So you want to make sure because we don't know we're allergic to things or we, we our stomach can't take certain things until we intake it and that's understandable all right let's go in the other direction all right thank you have a wonderful weekend all right all right you'll start to unsafe your safe side in the other direction so you want to make sure that you eat breakfast every day eat a breakfast every day if it's a banana, a cup of yogurt, an apple, a, a, you know, if you cook a whole breakfast, some grits, eggs, and bacon, something, eat breakfast, a granola bar, eat breakfast every day. Um, lift weights, be prepared for setbacks, because there's always going to be a setback. Even even I have setbacks, and I worked out faithfully. We, we're going to have setbacks. I had to go on my prednisone, steroids. My gut is like, I'm like, ooh. And then I, I had to check, because I'm like, they up the dosage of the milk. I said, that's what it was. Because I'm like, wait a minute. Usually you get a little bit. But I'm like, this time it was excessive. And it was because I had COVID and he was worried. So I get it. Because y'all know I emailed him and I was going in like, listen. I put in too much work and time <laughs> for this. He said, well, we had to be careful. Uh, and they know how I am because I wouldn't have took it if I didn't know that. So I get it. I understand. But still. <laughs> be mindful of your carb intake. You definitely want to be mindful of your carb intake. If you're going to do carbs, doing it during the time that you're active, you're up moving, not when you're going home and you're going to get sedentary, sitting on the couch, scrolling, reading, watching TV, those type of things. So you want to do your carbs during the day. Okay? Stay hydrated. As Miss April said, drink your water. Um, <laughs> if you're not drinking your water, find you some water that works. I, I found Circle. It's been helping me a lot because my water intake is a whole lot better. Now, don't get discouraged. Let's review more strategies. Weight regain is common. Just like a plateau is common. It's all a part of the journey. It's all about lessons learned, lessons lived, and lessons to get over. Okay? <laughs> Stick to a plan. Find a plan that works. Find your trainer. Find your group. Find a partner. Find somebody that's going to help you be accountable. Find a great support system. PNK Fitness 4.21. Find a great support. 
<laughs> find a great support system. Track your food intake. I use MyFitnessPal.com. I use it and then I don't use it and like now I'm using it again because it's the winter time. So I want to make sure I stay on track because we're at home more than we're out more. So we munch more. So I want to make sure my munching ain't above. If you're trying to lose weight, you want to stay in a calorie deficit. If you're trying to gain weight, you want to overeat but not over, over, overeat. Okay? So you just want to be mindful of that. My fitness pal, every time you enter that entry at the end of the day, it's going to tell you what your weight will be if you ate that way every day for the next three or four or five weeks. Okay? So that's why I like my fitness pal. Control your stress levels. Don't let where you want to be that you did not get to be stress you out. We got other things in life. Work, kids, spouses, mamas, that's going to stress you out enough. Okay? And yourself from overthinking. <laughs> Live, live the way you need to live and do it accordingly. If you find yourself getting stressed, take a moment to meditate, relax, clear your mind. Just, just, just do that. Do that to yourself. Eat plenty of vegetables. Not for me, I'm allergic. I can't do that. But eat plenty of vegetables if you can. Um, I find that if you're going to do the vegetables, if you don't do the ones like out of the garden, the ones in the grocery store is good, but if you're going to overbuy them, Buy the frozen ones instead of buying them and then freeze them. You might as well just buy the frozen ones. <laughs> I find the frozen ones work. Right. The frozen ones are already frozen. You, you know, you don't have to go home. Just it, just buy the frozen ones. Um, it's, it, it'd be a lot more efficient for you. Um, practice mindful eating. So practice mindful eating. Think about it. Don't think, think, think too much about it. Don't restrict yourself. But practice mindful eating means sizes, portion control. Make sure you got your protein, your vegetable, your starches. You make sure you got what you're supposed to have on your plate. And make sure that if you want to slice the dessert, have your slice of dessert. Not a chunk of a slice, but a slice. And some people say, oh, let me get a slice of cake. And then they cake like that. Why? Baby, that's not a slice. <laughs> that's not a slice. Uh, all right. <laughs> Right, you know they do grab. That's why we cut yeah. birthday cake. I'm like, ah, oh, that's too big. Make sustainable change to your lifestyle. You cannot you cannot continue the lifestyle that you're living when you're trying to make a shift change in your transformation of your health. You have to make a life change. So why do people gain weight? It's because of their mindset. It's because of the restrictive diets. It's because of the lack of sustainable habits. We have a lot of bad habits. A lot of people get on the, the, the wagon, I should say, when trends come out. You don't hear them talking about keto like they used to. Keto is all everybody talking about. When I watch that young lady, because they don't tell you the side effects. They had, they had all them gallstones, uh, uh, emergency surgery. She had over 100 of them. That's some of the side effects of eating all of that. Yes. So just be mindful of that stuff. That's why I say do your research. Read people reviews. Everything doesn't happen to everybody. But just be conscious of it, okay? Through your journey, you will realize controlling your weight is much more than just what you eat. Sleep, health, mental, emotional, and spiritual all play a big role in that. So bottom line is, diets can be restrictive and unrealistic, which leads to weight gain and make habits that are easy to stick to and help maintain. You break them and you get your weight gain. It's possible for weight maintenance to be effortless if you simply adopt the new lifestyle rather than going on a lot of the weight loss diet fast. All right, y'all, I didn't start the time. Jay, what we got left? Um, two more minutes. Oh, I was rushing because I thought I was almost done. I thought we was almost done. You sure? Jesus. <laughs> Woo! If you want information on the Love You Fitness Hoop, and I'm going to go back to talking about that, PerryHuluHuQueen.com. P-E-R-I-H-U-L-A-H-W-O-P-Q-U-E-E-N.com. Let me tell you, Dina. I mean, they can't order Gut Buster first. They, they, uh, Dina's going to be like, uh-uh. Plus, it's not in season to order a Gut Buster right now. So, as a beginner, you're going to go get a five-pound large. Nothing heavier than a six-pound, but a five-pound large. Well, make sure you're keeping that hoop up here and not down there on your hip bones. That's the whole target focus, your waistline. Ooh, come on, Cora. So I had hit Miss Dina up, the lady who makes the luxury fitness hoop. I don't know if y'all see my, my, my huggy that's on Shake It Back, baby back there. So I got some foot tires. I said, ooh, do you have some in stock? She's like, no. I said, I need two and I need them by Monday. 
Y'all know she put them in the mail to me yesterday. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, she came through for me. She came through. So I'm like, yes. Because I'm like, on Monday, we're going to be some flipping monkeys, okay? <laughs> so, yeah. So we just be conscious of your weight gain, your weight loss. A lot of people like to get on the scale regularly. I don't suggest it, but, you know, a lot of people like to. But I feel like the scale... Ugh, you can feel in your body when you're losing and when you're gaining. You know. Your body will change. Your clothes, your tire will change. And Miss April said the other day somebody noticed, right? Because I tell you all the time, somebody else that you haven't seen in a while will pick up on it. You know, you know the funny thing is, us women can look at somebody and see a change. But we, so, that's time. But we so funny to give, I don't know why it's so difficult for a woman to give another woman a compliment. I know, right? I don't understand that. When I, but you can still give a nod or a little smirk a little, it, it, you know, and you and you never know what somebody is going through. When I ran into a young lady downtown and I hugged her, she said, I always run into you at the right time. She said, nobody hugs me. She said, every time I see you, you give me a hug. And she said, you don't know how much that hug meant to me. And that, that made me feel good. So I'm like, I'm not going to change who I am. Because you never know what people are going through inside. So just, just a hello, a smile, a head nod goes a long way. All right, y'all, that is our time. Y'all have a blessed and wonderful day. Remember, it takes 80% nutrition, 20% exercise. It's going to give you 100% results because results require action. If it doesn't challenge you, it won't change you. Choices, chances change. You must make a choice to take a chance for a life won't change for you. If you're not struggling, you won't see any progress. If you're not progressing, it's because you're not allowing yourself to struggle. You can think a lot of things, but what? Hard work. Hard work is definitely not one of them. Live life. Don't allow life to live you. You are enough. Turn down that volume of self-doubt and turn up the volume of self-confidence. And you are enough because you chose you. Listen, focus on the process and not the what? I challenged him. This was from yesterday. Results. That's a new one. I, yeah, I, I, it was a new one I introduced yesterday. I, I, I snuck that in yesterday. It's, you know every year I add a new nugget. So the new nugget is now that's added into the equation is <laughs> focus on the process and not the results. And you'll get you'll get a long you'll get further ahead than you want to in your lifelong journey of longevity. Alright everybody, y'all stay blessed, remain prayed up, continue to wash your hands, mask on, social distance when necessary. I'm your girl, Coach Pinky. I'ma see y'all on the flip side. Y'all have an amazing day. Stay awesome and don't forget to smile all right and don't forget turn those negatives into positives and good vibes only in your energy of your circle have an amazing day we out all right ladies have a blessed one oh y'all did 40 10 30 15 and 2010 so remember when i said oh remember remember when i said oh did y'all hear me that's what i had slipped and said that's what i had slipped and said that's it. I said, I said, ooh, did y'all hear me? And y'all was like, no. I was like, okay. But I was like, I said, they, I said, I'm surprised. Jada was like, that was kind of long. <laughs> I was like, yeah, y'all did. So y'all did 40, 10. Because I, I know, you know, people keep a journal. 40, 10, 30, 10, 30, 15, and 20, 10. Okay. Y'all did good, though. Y'all rocked it out. That's why these arms be looking like. <laughs>